Hello and welcome to Community Chats. I'm your host, Ali Hammer, and today we're joined with Matt Sanders from TSA Group. Matt, thank you so much for being on the show today. Can you start by telling our audience a little bit about TSA Group and what it is that you guys do? Yeah, thanks, Ali. Thanks for having me on. So TSA is a, a really interesting organisation. So on, on one hand, we're a really established, large organisation. So about 3,000 team members spread across Australia and the Philippines. Uh, we're one of Australia's largest outsourced contact center providers. So we, we service a lot of Australia's biggest brands and close clients. Um, and we're 24 years old. So we've been around since 1997, founded in Perth. So on one hand, you have this really large established business. On the other side, we have a real entrepreneurial industry. So uh, in the last few years, we've launched our contact center technology arm to our business. Um, and we're really focused on creating and bringing to market a holistic contact center services. So one thing with TSA, we're really purpose driven. So our purpose that we've spent a lot of time aligning our business around is we're here to create experiences that people love um, and by revolutionizing the way uh, they interact with the brands that they deal with. So we're really purpose driven. We have a really big goal to be Australia's leading um, provider of customer service uh, and experiences. Um, and we're really excited to, to launch the technology side of our business in partnership with, with you guys at Amazon. It seems like the work that you do has had such a huge impact on so many businesses and you really have come a long way from where you were 20 years ago. So where does AWS fit in with this? And more specifically, can you talk to us a little bit about how you're delivering Amazon Connect for Australian businesses? Yeah, it's a really good question and a really interesting journey, which kind of sets us apart a bit in the market. So um, about three years ago, uh, we came to the realisation that our legacy contact centre technology just wasn't going to allow us to do what we wanted to do for our own business and for our clients and our clients' customers. Um, so we faced the reality that we had to pick a new path. So we deep dive into the globe's best contact centre technology providers and vendors and ecosystems. And we spent about six months experimenting, trialling, testing, stretching different providers. Uh, and spoiler alert, obviously, we, we, we ended up partnering with AWS and Amazon Connect. Um, what's really unique about Amazon Connect in the market um, is the flexibility. So, as we all know, we've seen COVID, what's happening with COVID, the need to be flexible, working from home, provide, you know, really rapid responses to client, you know, increasing client volumes of, of contacts. Um, that flexibility is, is just part of BAU now. So you need your contact centre technology to be able to adapt and change uh, and deliver solutions in real time um, for, for businesses. So it's really interesting, Ali, we went on a journey never to commercialise this capability. So we set off on this journey a little bit like Amazon Connect itself to build it for yourselves. Um, we uh, built Amazon Connect for us. Um, so we went through proof of concepting and testing, um, moving into production, building a bunch of software and capability uh, in Amazon Connect and AWS, which over the last two odd years, we started to realise how much the market actually wanted the same kind of capability. So when we're talking to our existing contacts and outsourced customers, they just kept saying to us, we're, we're really struggling. Our technology is not enabling us to do what we want to do, facing the same challenges that we'd already faced into. Um, and where we've sort of found ourselves is the intersection between um, Amazon Connect disrupting the contact center technology market, uh, and then TSA with our capability and our software that we've built on top of Amazon Connect, coming in, being able to rapidly help clients really go through the same challenges that we went through. And one of the things I've really realised in the market is we live and breathe contact centres at TSA. It's what we're passionate about. It's what we love. It's what we do. Businesses out there aren't like that. They don't, their best, best brains are spent focusing on what they do as an organisation, whether it be retail or banking or energy. Um, so when it comes to their contact centre technology and operations, they really need a partner to help them on that journey. And we're lucky enough to be that partner uh, at a time the market's really transforming. So... It's a long-winded way of saying um, we kind of found ourselves here by chance, but uh, we love where we are and just recently being awarded the um, first Australian business to be an Amazon Connect service delivery partner is really something we're really proud of and, and we're just really passionate and excited about being able to help companies on the journey that, that we went through. I think it's so awesome that our customers like yourself are using Connect to build even more tailored solutions, which can then actually be used for broader use cases. So it's amazing what you're doing. So why did you choose Amazon Connect specifically and what impact has it had on your customers? You've spoken a little bit about that already, but you can go into it more deeply. Yeah, absolutely. I think there's a, there's a few different things, Ali, when it comes to Amazon Connect that it delivers multiple things that clients are looking for. So the first is a cloud contact center solution. 
So firstly, with the need for rapid upscaling, the need for work from home, cloud contact center solutions are really taking over from on-prem. So that's the first one. And, and the, the advantage that Amazon Connect has with AWS is it's cloud native. Secondly, you have on top of that, the security benefits. So by having your own private cloud environment, you allow your data to be quarantined with an environment you control. And that obviously has a range of benefits. Uh, sovereignty, PCI compliance, range of different benefits for different industries that have different regulations. Um, and then the third piece, which is really, really important, is just the ability to innovate and experiment. So Amazon connects a really powerful telephony and chat engine. But on top of that, you've got access to all the AWS ecosystems. So all the services like Amazon Transcribe, Amazon Contact Lens, Amazon Poly, all the machine learning elements, your ability to tap into these services and experiment with new agent experiences and new customer experiences. And to do that in a really cost-effective, non-commitment way is just something you don't get anywhere else in the market. So it really is, I mean, our, what we say to our clients is the best innovations and ideas uh, and, and new ways of doing things come, you already kind of know what you've got to do. Your agents know, your customers know, your business knows. Um, so it's really just enabling that. And Amazon Connect really does that in a really powerful way. Um, and again, shameless plug, but with TSA there to support as a partner, we can do that in ways customers are just blown away. Well, I'm so glad that you see the benefits of Amazon Connect because we clearly love it as much as you do. And considering cost center technology has been around for so long and it's something that is quite uniform across many organizations, why do you think the TSA group is so different from those other businesses in this industry? It's a great question. Um, and, and I can probably boil it down to, to one main thing is that we were born a contact center operator. So when we go to market, we come with 24 years experience in running enterprise grade contact centers for some of Australia's biggest brands. So we've got a really unique outlook and perspective on what it takes to have a really great contact center technology. So we have over, I think, 13 million customer directions a year that, that we handle for our clients. Um, so that alone gives us such a great insight into what Australians want from a contact center experience. You add on top of that, all the operational expertise we have from all the value chains run by running the contact center, recruitment, training, workforce management, operations, process design, you name it. If it happens in a contact center, we do it. And then on top of that, we've added the technology. Capability. So we're really different from a traditional tech vendor or tech consultant. Um, our business was born out of uh, our own need uh, and our capability is really focused on how we deliver and then optimise and ongoing the support our clients with their contacts and tech. So it's very different from a, we build a product, here it is, here, good luck using it. It's really that partnership approach that sort of differentiates us. And to be honest, that, that's why we're in the sector um, because that's what uh, the market keeps selling us that, that they're looking for. Well, it sounds like an awesome solution. And I think your passion is actually what sets you apart from the competition. Working with a partner that is truly passionate about, about what they do makes such a huge difference. And this is what I see in TSA Group. So finally, Matt, can you walk us through some of our joint customers and how you're delighting them in the market? Yeah, thanks, Ali. I think um, the, one of the best examples we have at the moment is JB Hi-Fi. So JB Hi-Fi, um, going into COVID had a real large impact on their business. Um, obviously, with lockdowns and impacts on retail um, and with the associated demand with, with their, for their products, given everyone moving to work from home, um, they needed some support rapidly to stand up um, really large scale inbound contact center sales capability. Um, so, we worked with them to rapidly discover, design, build, launch an Amazon Connect based contact center solution. Um, that their team members within store actually logged on to um, and service customers uh, during that period. Um, it's been in place across COVID and it's still in place today. So you'll see there's one three JB Hi-Fi. Um, we've had over 2,000 agents at one time in the platform. Um, and that's something that we're really proud of. Um, it's something we've really supported them with from end to end and we continue to support them with it today and extend and, and optimize it. Um, but for us, it was a really great example of how we can take Amazon Connect and TSA's capability and, and one, keep those team members for JB Hi-Fi engaged, employed, productive, enable them to support their customers. So the other great example um, is a long-time client of ours, uh, GA Childcare. They have um, the largest number of childcare centers across Australia, Jelly Beans and a range of other brands. Um, and we rolled out Amazon Connect for them as their omni-channel uh, enterprise-grade contact solution. 
Um, so that does everything from inbound voice, outbound voice, uh, live chat, um, email. Uh, it's a solution that has really helped them look after their families uh, and what they call family support officer roles, which basically means you, you get allocated to a family support officer and they'll support you across any channel, with your voice, with your messaging, with your email, um, and allows them to provide a service to their customers um, that really sets them apart in the market. Those are some amazing case studies, Matt. Thank you so much for sharing. I mean, personally, Connect is one of my favorite Amazon services. So thank you so much for coming on the show and sharing all of that TSA group. If anyone's got any comments, please pop them in the comment section below and we'll get back to you soon. Thanks, thank you so yeah. much.